So this is the Shun Sora utility knife. This is the Victorinox Fibrox utility knife. The Victorinox Fibrox utility knife is four and a half inches. The Shun utility knife is six inches, I wanna say. Yeah, six inches. Let's talk about similarities. Both have a lifetime warranty. Both use pretty high quality steel. Both have plastic handles. Let's continue though. First difference between these two is this has a full tang, which means the blade extends all the way down. This does not. The blade sort of ends right here. The rest is plastic molded around it. Second difference. This is serrated. Weird, I know, but makes it more utilitarian. Third difference is this uses a lower quality steel than this does. This uses VG10. This uses a random sort of, it has a really long name, but the end result is 61 hardness, 58 hardness. What that means is this is much more resilient to wearing down. It's gonna keep its edge a lot longer. But the opposite side of that coin is that since it is harder, it's also a little bit more brittle, which means you can't be whacking things with it. You can't be hitting it against a table and stuff because it will chip. That's a little bit more resistant to chipping because it's softer. If you whack it, it just sort of deforms. If you whack this, it'll chip. It shouldn't make that big of a difference because you should always be using your knives properly. Next difference is, this is just one piece of steel. This is actually VG10 that then has two layers of steel wrapped around it and welded, which creates this sort of gorgeous wave pattern on it. But what that means is that it's much more resilient to staining, pitting, rust, things like that, while that isn't. Also, when you really compare them, that looks sort of like a high-end knife, like a piece of art. You can see that wave design. That looks very utilitarian. It looks like it's meant to be a cheap, effective knife. If you like that, you like that. If you want something that's more like jewelry for your kitchen, that you want to sort of show off and brag about, this will be the knife you get in that, sense, in that essence. The last difference is, and one of the main reasons I prefer Shun knives to essentially any other brand, all Shuns come with lifetime sharpening for free. And if you guys have never had your knives sharpened by a reputable place, it costs a couple of bucks per inch of a knife, and it costs a couple of bucks per inch more if it's a serrated knife. So what that means is while this is cheaper, at the end of the day, all it takes is one time of you mailing this in, they sharpen it themselves, they send it back for free, and if there's any problem with it when it's there, they'll just send you a brand new knife. All it takes is one time of you doing that and getting a brand new knife essentially sharpened by the manufacturer that this becomes not the cheaper knife. So if you're willing to spend a little bit more off the bat to get better quality steel, to get a better built knife, to get something with a true lifetime warranty and free sharpening that looks like art for your kitchen, I would always suggest buy once, cry once, get the Shun Sora. It's still a very budget conscious knife, but at the end of the day, it is built to last, whereas this is meant to be sort of a disposable knife essentially for a uh, kitchen. Both have their merits, both are very sharp, both are very effective. It just depends on what you want for your own home and for your own work. If you have any questions, let me know. If you have any comments, let me know. I'll put a link down to both of these below and I will talk to you very soon.